Hi, I'm Mike. I'm the pastor here at Shepherd of the Hills, and this is... I'm Landy Hansen, and I'm the current president of the uh, council here at Shepherd of the Hills. We've got a few things we want to bring up to date on, and uh, we've got a lot of wonderful stuff going on, but why don't we start out with what happened at council last week? Well, we had a, a great council meeting. We had uh, three of the uh, impact students. It was uh, Alex, Natalie, and Kendra came to uh, council to present some of the goals and objectives that the uh, they have moving forward. And uh, I have to say council was really, uh, really impressed. We thought they did a really nice job. And one of the things they brought with them was this flow chart and uh, very organized. I was really, really impressed. And uh, I think hats off to Pastor Anna for doing a great job of uh, leading these young kids. Mm -hmm. They were very sharp, presented themselves well, and gave us a lot to think about. So we really appreciated that. Should we talk a little bit about Holy Week? Sure. We are excited. Holy Week is coming up. April 2nd is Palm Sunday. So that is our two traditional service times, 8.30 and 10.30. On Monday, Thursday, we have one service at 6.30. Now, we're doing something a little different for Monday, Thursday. We're doing a drama, and it's going to be recreating the Last Supper and the events that's surrounding it. It's very exciting. We think it's going to be a wonderful worship experience. We hope to have you there for that. Friday, Good Friday, April I got to think about this. Uh, April 7th is going to be our Good Friday service at 6.30 p.m. And that'll be the traditional choir, songs, readings, candles. It's an amazing service. And then Easter, we've got uh, three services, 8, 9.30, and 11. It's going to be wonderful. We hope to see you all there. Sounds and, good. And you had some other stuff you wanted to share. Well, another thing that kind of come up at council and uh, is... Uh, been kind of important to me and that's uh, taking ownership of what we've got going here at Shepherd of the Hills and I've used myself as an example of somebody that's needed to get a little, a little bit more involved and uh, you know I found myself just coming to Shepherd of the Hills and kind of not doing my part and uh, so you know by getting a little bit more involved I had a church member come up to me and and ask if I'd be interested in council and I have to say, if it wasn't for them tapping me on the shoulder and giving me a little prodding, I don't know that I would have done it. But I think there's so many things that we can do here with Shepherd of the Hills that make a big difference. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, sing in the choir, uh, usher, mm -hmm. work at the Welcome Center, greet, uh, be involved in council. We have so many great things and we have such a great congregation here. Um, and so many people have done so much. I think we just need to try to look at ways that we can help them out even more. Mm -hmm. I agree. It is amazing just how different people chip in, whether we're talking Monday nights with Alpha, Sunday nights with the kids, or the junior high or the senior high. There's a lot of wonderful ministries and a lot of opportunities and a lot of great volunteers that really make this congregation work and be healthy. And we want to thank you all for that. We want to encourage you guys to step up. There's wonderful ways to be involved. Yeah. Anything else you want to add to that? I'm just really excited. We have a lot of good things going here at Shepherd the Hills. And uh, the more we can do, the better the place will be and, and the, the more worship we can provide. Mm -hmm. I am really excited where we're at in the congregation. I'm really excited about Holy Week and everything going on. I hope to see you there. I think we're set. Yeah. You have a blessed day.